God be gracious to us, make his face shine down. God be gracious to us, and make his ways known. All right, so what's your name? My name is Steve Westcott, and okay. I'm walking from the Space Needle in Seattle, Washington, to Times Square in New York City. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. My, my travel should be about 36, 35, 3600 miles. I've already done about 1,050. Oh man, that's um, awesome. So I've walked from Seattle to Portland, to Bend, Oregon, to Boise, Burley, Oh Tremont, my gosh. And then here. Wow. Um, my only rule is I have to walk every single mile. I can't get rides within a city. Right. But I have to get brought back to where I'm at. So I'm getting picked up right now to go to somebody's house to stay the night. Right. Um, yeah. So yeah, that's, that's cool. It. Oh, I'm and doing it to raise money to build an orphanage in Kenya. Okay. My best friend started an organization called Zima. Okay. And he... Uh, it's it's a drug rehab and a children's center. That's I, awesome. My part is to build the orphanage, and so I'm ra trying to raise two hundred thousand dollars. Wow! And that's a lot of money to try to raise. But we don't yeah. have to depend on Mama America like other organizations. They exactly, like the you. government waiting on them and yeah. stuff. Yeah, we always, they always God want you to like, please donate, please donate, please donate. Please donate. We just want to get this thing built. Yeah. Self-sufficient and farming things like that. That's so, great. And then, do you guys have like a website or anything like that? Yeah, you can go to if you just Google needle the number two square so needle to square okay um you'll find my blog my twitter my facebook my youtube channel my mom's okay. <laughs> cell phone number cool okay. yeah well we'll look you up and we'll make sure to put this on so other people can uh, support you with this oh, yeah and so tell us a little bit about your friend over here yes i've got leroy brown he is a He's a hip-hop goat, so I call him Leroy Breezy. <laughs> That's <the> awesome. <laughs> He's a small goat for pack animals. He's only 110 pounds. They want right. you to have like 150 to 250 pounds. But I wanted yeah. a goat. Like if he got wild on me, I could wrestle it to the ground. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm a city kid, so this is like my, my first time even, you know, hanging with a goat. Wow, how what's been what's your experience been like? Uh, Dude, he's so he's so rad. He's way know? cool. Yeah, he like <laughs> He, he'll like, he just, he, he's very clever. He knows what I need and what I want. He knows yeah. what to do. Yeah. And like, he, like when we take rest, he'll just kind of curl up next to me and just put his head on me or something. And that's, yeah. So that's we just, awesome. We just hang out. I, he thinks I'm a goat. I think. <laughs> so like, I'm, I'm like a companion goat. Because yeah. you're supposed to take two at a time, but I figured... We're gonna, never going to be apart, really. You're so. both too, so... <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. That's cool. Well, I kind of liked what you said before when I asked you if he was your pet. He's... Oh, uh, yeah. You, yeah. You can't... Um, you can't own a friend. I mean, you know what I'm yeah. he's, he's not a pet. He's a friend, so... <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. So, here's this cool goat. He's, he's awesome. five years old. Five years old. Um, and, and he's just chilling there. I got there. him from a goat rescue, actually. Oh, that's great. His original yeah. name was Popsicle, but I didn't want to be walking across America going, Here, Popsicle! Here's Popsicle! Here's Popsicle! Yeah. So I changed his name to Leroy. Yeah. Leroy sounds like, I can yell Leroy, like, Leroy, let's go! You know? Sometimes yeah. when I'm by myself and it's just me and him, I'm like, hey, are you ready to go? And then I laugh to myself. And That's just, great, dude. <laughs> he just kind of looks at me like, what? That's awesome. So you just got a tattoo right now. So where'd you get? Yeah, I got, um, well... You can't really see. You can't it. really see what it is, but it's, it's his head with, with like um, crossbones behind. It says N two S, which is needle two square. So. Okay, yeah. yeah, awesome. So, what made you um, even begin to think to like raise money for an orphanage? Are you religious in any way? Or yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay. uh, I'm a Christian, and I know this sounds crazy because it's like, I mean. <laughs> to say like the Lord put this in my life so the yeah. Lord wanted me to walk across America with a goat but I yeah. mean that's that's the reality that's of it that's kind of what happened and it, it is it's like the well, absolute reality and so guess what we're related brother because okay. I'm, I'm a Christian too good that's and great. I love Jesus too so I totally understand like the call yeah, that yeah, God yeah, put yeah. on your heart so yeah and it yeah. was at first he didn't say goat so it, like he's like walk across America and that I could handle I mean if he yeah. would have said right up front like you should take a goat too I'd be like I don't know if I'm yeah. hearing from the Lord <laughs> <laughs> so yeah like, I need to double check this. <laughs> yeah. Where is this in the scriptures, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I just felt I, I was, uh, I used to be in a band. We were playing like 300 shows a year. Yeah. Uh, so I was always on tour. Um, right. He, I, it was December 12, 2010. Right. Um, and I was walking up the stairs to the apartment. And I looked at the drummer. I, we had two weeks off right. for Christmas. I looked at the drummer. I said, hey, um, as soon as the band's over, I'm, I'm going to walk yeah. across America and uh, 
wow. two months later, they kicked me out. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. <laughs> no, it's, it's good. I mean, it was totally, honestly, I wasn't ready to give it up. Like, I didn't So want, it kind of needed to happen yeah, like that a little bit, yeah. Because, you know, no matter what, I wanted to be obedient. Yeah. But when you're living that life, you know, touring yeah. and being living the rock star life or whatever you yeah you don't want to give that up yeah you kind of get caught up in it you yeah. know the just the i don't know the, the fun lifestyle. of it and the yeah. craziness of it you know so, just so yeah i mean it's been the best thing for me i've had to grow up which is good because i'm 33 it's time <laughs> yeah that's awesome um and so yeah uh from there like it just started where i didn't want to be just a guy walking across america i thought that was kind of stupid and just a waste of my time. I needed to stand for something. I needed purpose. Yeah, there it, needed so. to be some kind of purpose for sure. Yeah. So yeah. I I started contact like all these different organizations, Restore International, Compassion International, all these things. And yeah. No one really wanted to partner with me. They just wanted me to write a check when we're done. Yeah. And that that was, wasn't my heart. I needed yeah. to be more than that. So yeah, of course. Uh, this whole time I'm looking for this an organization. My best friend was in Kenya starting this organization. Oh my gosh, so, dude. Like, Four months before I started, I started this project. I'm like, oh, I'm just, I'm running out of time. And I picked yeah. him up from the airport. He told me what he's yeah. doing. I told him what I was doing. It was just like destiny. And like, it was perfect. Yeah. yeah. So we've been it's friends. It's awesome. We toured together a bunch all over the world. And cool. and uh, he, I mean, it's just, it's totally the Lord, you know. Like, yeah, it, definitely. It, it was timing. If I wouldn't have been left the band, I wouldn't have been ready for when he came back. And, exactly. And just everything. So yeah. Well, that's awesome. And, um, you know, we're going to try to do what we can to support you by making sure this video goes everywhere. Absolutely. And, um, but Wait, yeah, we, name? my name's Martha. Martha <laughs> yeah. It's, hey, it's nice to meet you, Steve. And this is George here. <laughs> George, nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, awesome. and we love Jesus. We go to a church here. It's called God's Place. And, cool. um, yeah, so we totally dig what you're doing, you know, oh, and support awesome. you. So we'll be keeping you in prayer and I'll let my church know too, just to yes. keep you in prayer and stuff. Send so. that to me. Or yeah. Post it to my Facebook. Yeah. Um. We'll we'll friend you on Facebook and stuff, and then that way I we could do something <laughs> to end it, huh? <laughs> All right. And that there you go, you guys. Amazing story about a guy and his goat. <laughs> and um, it's more than that. There's a bigger issue behind it, and it's a really awesome, awesome thing, um, and a noble thing to be doing. So it's really awesome. All right. Oh <laughs> yeah. Lead me to waters and pastures so green. Oh, you pour out your oil and choose goodness and mercy for me. Oh, you lead me to waters and pastures so green. Oh, you pour out your oil and choose goodness and mercy for me.